Now weather coverage you can count on. WJBF Live by Persis. Well, this was the scene this morning, downtown Augusta, the Jesse Norman Amphitheater. You can see there's the Savannah River. It's been rising and now it's starting to encroach there on the amphitheater. You can see you can't see the ground and that water was continuing to rise all the way up to the first level there. So again, that area has been closed off. Uh, you cannot access uh, any of the lower part of that uh, near that river walk there as that water is expected to continue to rise with additional rain. Also the release from Thurman Dam as well. So again, more rain on the way. Here's a look at what we've got as we go through the rest of the afternoon. Not a whole lot of activity right now. It is warm. It is steamy out there. But once we hit around 2 o'clock this afternoon, that's when we anticipate most of the rain to start forming here. And again, the coverage going to increase. We're expecting a stormy afternoon and evening. Some very heavy downpours as well. Highs into the upper 80s for today. 77 degrees with some lingering showers at 8 p.m. tonight. Now, we did mention this uh, at the beginning of the show here that if you live along any one of these rivers, Butler Creek at the uh, at Augusta right near the Savannah River, the Ogeechee River near Midville or the Saluda River. Uh, again, you need to watch out. These rivers are running very high, especially right along the Savannah. Now uh, flood stage, I believe is about 117 and it's going to be running a little bit high over the next couple of days. So watch out. River flooding certainly going to be a concern here. In fact, all those bright green counties you see, those are where you have the current river flood warnings. That darker shade of green, an area wide flood a flash flood watch. So again, just like yesterday, a very heavy downpour is expected and that can certainly cause some flash flooding uh, in a very short amount of time here. Again, just some scattered cloud cover right now. Not a whole lot on the radar, but again, this will likely change in the next couple of hours. In the meantime, temperatures have warmed up. You got low to mid 80s on the map here. When you factor that in with a very high moisture right now, it creates those feels like temperatures a little bit closer to 90. That's what it feels like right now for Augusta and Waynesboro at this time. So Here's a look at the setup. The reason why we're anticipating, I think, better coverage of rainfall today is because of this system, a cold front, which is slowing down, trying to work into our area. Now that's a little bit closer to us, we are going to watch for that to sort of give us a little bit more umph, a little bit more energy to work with here. So we're anticipating those showers and thunderstorms to be a little bit more numerous today. The other thing that we're watching is this. This is actually what's left over from Tropical Storm Chantal. You remember that system sort of fell apart over the Caribbean, but the moisture from this is starting to work towards the southeast United States. Now, if that were to work into the area, our rain chances would be a bit higher as we head for your upcoming weekend and early next week. In the meantime, let's get through today and time it out for you as we hit that two o'clock hour. Here we go. Some showers and thunderstorms starting to blossom in the warmth and the humidity of the afternoon. Watch out for some very heavy downpours and the coverage will increase as we hit towards 4 p.m. this afternoon and we'll stick around here even towards 6, 7 o'clock tonight. If you have any evening plans, again, watch out. These are going to be some very prolific downpours, going to be very difficult to drive through. And again, do not drive through flooded waters. It's uh, not good for your car and certainly not good for you as well. We'll be looking at some scattered shower chances to continue right into your Friday as well, and we're talking some substantial rainfall amounts here. See the area in red and see that pink area. The model indicating about two to five inches of rain over the next couple of days here, right in through week, the weekend and early next week. So watch out there. 88 for today, scattered thunderstorms. Tonight we fall to around 72 degrees, keeping it mostly cloudy. And again, a lot of cloud cover and again, staying pretty wet and unsettled as we hit the daytime on your Friday. Rain chances stay relatively high for the weekend at 50%. Right now, 40% early next week, but if that moisture from uh, what's left over of Chantal comes into play, we'll have to bump up those rain chances. So again, staying unsettled, have the umbrellas, and we can't stress this enough. We saw this a lot yesterday. Do not drive through flooded streets. Again, not good for anyone. Not at all. all right. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> Quick.